Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to Hybrid Movies. We are finally back after like a super long hiatus. We're <laughs> joined, as always, by Luke. Hey, guys, what's up? James. Hi, Dilio neighborinos. And we got Will this time too. What's poppin', people? Dude, speaking of dumpster fires, uh, the Predator has apparently reshot the entire third <laughs> act and ending. Why? <laughs> God damn. That was really <laughs> sad. <laughs> they Okay, so this movie, so we had heard about reshoots. I think we talked about the reshoots actually a couple episodes ago. Uh, they, they confirmed they were new scenes, but we didn't know where these new scenes would be placed. Are they going to be like spread throughout? Did they try and beef up characters? But mm -hmm. no, apparently it's they just redid the entire third act sequences and the ending and everything. So it's like, mm -hmm. wow, okay. that's not good at all. It's random. A little fishy. <laughs> hey James, what do you think about this? The they they, they changed up the whole ending. I guess it's like a Rogue One kind of. Like, well, I mean, like in Rogue in Rogue One's case, like, I mean, I enjoyed Rogue One, but at the same time, you know, just reading through like the trouble production and just reworking to the third act, I I can't imagine the stress like it puts on. You know, it puts on, like, the director and actors. And I imagine, like, it's probably the same, you know, for this Predator movie. But the thing is, but the thing is, is just, like, you know, with Rogue One, like, they did, you know, before they did the reshoots, they at least, you know, gave us some promotional material. You know, like a trailer, you know, some posters and whatnot. Um, we, you know, we haven't really had anything aside you know, for the Predator, aside from that one teaser poster I remember you sharing. Well, there's, like, some cast photos and, like, behind-the-scenes stuff, I get, like, set photos, but that's really mm -hmm. it. Yeah. Which is another thing I wanted to touch on, too. So, I feel like this movie has had, like, a really big uphill battle because the script leaked out, people saw, like, all the drastic changes that Shane Black was putting into the movie to kind of change up the lore and everything. Mm -hmm. And the funny thing is, like, people have been saying, where's the trailer at? Where is it? We, is it are we finally going to see some kind of We footage? got a fake trailer. And <laughs> oh, that's right. There is no trailer. <laughs> I forgot. And every time, every time it seems like the trailer is coming, he's like, oh, no, it got pushed back. Or, like, the trailer release got delayed. And blah. I mean, the movie comes out September. We're now roughly, what, five months mm -hmm. away? And mm -hmm. supposedly now the trailer is not even going to come out until early oh. May. So that's gonna be a four month window that they're starting the marketing. That's kind of that seems very that like weird. soon. Well, that's some. Well, that's similar to what Solo's been doing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's also another really troubled production. Yeah. Well, I, what I was gonna say is like it seems like they're trying to like hide the movie or something almost. Like, so mm -hmm. Shane, uh, somebody asked him on Twitter. They're like, "Hey, what's going on?" There's been a bunch of rumors that there's like trouble with the movie and stuff and he's like oh don't worry we're gonna have a trailer out in mid uh april in like two weeks be on the lookout and then he comes out like a couple days later after everyone's made a video about it he comes out like two days later and is like he literally says whoops not <laughs> he says <laughs> he's like whoops uh Sorry. that trailer is only for CinemaCon people uh it'll be online at some point after that and it's like <laughs> not even to clarify but whoops Sorry. <laughs> Whoopsie. Yeah, so... Mistakes were made. Man, I really want to, like, support this movie and everything. I, I I, want it to do good because, obviously, I'm a fan of the franchise. I want to see more movies. I want to see more stuff happen. But at the same time, it's like this movie has had a lot of negative press surrounding it. It's, it's, mm -hmm. it's weird because... So Alien Covenant ended up being a movie that people didn't like... But it had this very much, like, hype factor around it. Like, people wanted to see it. Like, the trailers did pretty yeah. good and everything. Like, it had that that momentum behind it. But with this movie, it's like the negative effect. There's no trailer and nobody wants to see it. It's like... Which is weird, because, like, Predator, in terms of films alone, its movies actually aren't that bad. No, they yeah. aren't. Like, one is solid, two... Pretty two's good, actually you know? fine. Yeah, yeah, two's not bad. Predator's actually, aside from a few acting things it's all right for the most part like, like there's predator been nothing that's been downright offensive yeah there's yeah. nothing like horrible in this franchise even avp requiem the garbage dumpster that that is like predator in it is okay <laughs> hmm. well i i have like, i just have a feeling the director usually likes predator more because i mean predator's cooler but <laughs> he is cooler um, he has more weapons he does more stuff he has dreads culture yeah, he has he dreads. dreads. That's without. That's what I was getting at. Predator has dreads. Automatic Alien plus does 10 not. To, to coolness, dreadlocks. Yeah, I don't know. It's kind of with Will's thing. Like Predator, I would imagine 
something like that it would be getting the most hype because Predator is like this I don't know it has like a pretty big place in like pop culture the the mere idea that a Predator movie is coming and like nobody would know about it is really weird to me yeah you can't and like I'll... stealth drop that like 10 Cloverfield Lane like... dude and also um, Shane Black even before this had started filming when they first announced like three years ago and he was talking about it he's like yeah like I really want this to be like an event film that people like buy their tickets online and they know about this movie like it's a big hype summer movie and now it, like it's coming out and it's like they're trying to hide it and it's like no trailer no marketing you like think the merger is affecting it at all I can't uh, imagine so because this has been happening I, I before would, that I was would announced hope not. Wasn't nah. it? I don't think yeah. so but... I think it's the result of like it being so like different though like I was saying it's very much like changing a lot of things that people like the conventions people expect from a predator movie and plus right. we had heard that they tested they did like two test screenings and we heard that like the reception was pretty mixed like people were like not very much liking it or whatever so it's like i don't know what to do nick how would you feel if this was the the last jedi of the predator ah. franchise <laughs> that, those are his your expectations are his i thought we were done with this <laughs> we'll, we're never gonna be done with it, James. Apparently, yeah, like the Batman. legend will never die. It's like BVS and Justice League. People can still have exactly. To, like, it's never gonna that. be done. The the black cut of a predator, the original the one. black uh, cut. Yeah. Just like with the uh, new mutants. Get the I don't original know. I cut just, of that too. While we're at it, like I just really hope that we get like something from this movie. Like God, they're playing mm -hmm. this way too close to the chest. They they they're trying to be like they took. The whole predator thing, literally, like the, it is the marketing is literally like cloaked, like we can't see it. So. I was gonna say it's invisible. <laughs> yeah, so I don't know. I mean, hopefully there is a trailer at some point. I mean, I'd like to see something from the movie before it comes out, right? I mean, <laughs> mm -hmm. I mean, I would hope so. I don't want it to be like three months out. I like would solo, like a dude. visual representation that this movie is being worked on. Yes, yeah. that it exists. Yes, beyond the what four photos we have, beyond people's words.